just got up and put some wood in the fire. And we got the Shasta stove there. Working good. Modified it. Used to get a lot of smoke, so I put five holes in there. Really helped it out. Now it works good. And I got the leather right here. So, yeah. So I'm heating this up. And it should toast up. It's a heart healthy meal. Psychologically, it is. Oh, yeah, that feels nice and toasty, and uh, which means it'll be it'll be uh, very warm on the inside. So I'll cut that open with my Lands and Good Now knife, 1865 for real. I'll put the bacon in there and then I'll put in the bacon still hot which is good and uh, the cheese will melt and we'll be in good shape and I'll uh, have some coffee and uh, we'll be good man so let me get my Find my fork now. Where the hell I put that? Yeah, here it is. Might be a little hot, so let's see what we can do here. It's not fork split; it's knife split. Oh uh, yeah, a little greasy, but uh, once in a while I gotta. Treat yourself now. See how that? See how that? See how that steam in there? Now see. I'll put that cheese right in there. It'll melt big time. I, I like the cheddar cheese, and uh, we have good cheddar cheese here. This Vermont Cabot cheese. I got some leftover cheese here. Of course, my dog's eyeballing it. But and then we'll put. Uh, ah, yeah, you dirty. Son of a gun. You dirty son. There you go, man. There you go. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. And uh, yeah, a lot of people leave it folded like that and take it off and just place it right on top there, man. Now, you see, I pressed that down almost like a grilled cheese egg McMuffin without the egg. Thomas English muffin. And everything's nice and hot in there so that, that cheese is gonna melt. So I'll leave that in there for a while. I'll even put the spatula on top. But, uh, all right, I, uh, I do have cheese left over. So I think Maggie, what, what's up? Sit, sit. Sit. Hey. Paul. Paul. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, she's chowing down. Mm. There you go, man. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. There. One for you, one for me here. Oh, yeah. Keep her coming back. You ever food should do anything. What the hell's going on here? Just close that up a little bit. Hey, what are you doing there? So so. 
I keep some coffee out here, something easy. So it's nice and easy now. See, just tear it down. Good to go. Tell you what, you know, uh, I'll be doing the maple uh, syrup soon. And what's nice is you get the the fresh sap. You boil that up, not even filter it. And you make coffee or tea out of it. It's fantastic. So, but uh, that's really good. Some people come just for that. They could also make beer with it, too. But uh, some of the people, it's good for you. You know, it's nice. But, uh, and I usually, I don't take it out. I, I just take it. We got some stuff left in the lines when we pump it up into the tanks. Yeah, this is nice, man. It's going to have to cool. I see. Now. See how that cheese is all melting on the side already? See how crisp that is? Cheese is melting on the side, so it got real hot on the inside, almost like a microwave. It's hot in there. You put the, I had the hot bacon, too. Put the cheddar in there. Oh, man. All your cheese heads would be... Uh, well, cheese head crisp would want this. And uh, I don't have any hot sauce, though. I, I, I checked in there. I had an empty bottle of hot sauce. So, I bring out this morning. Normally, I would load this up with hot sauce, but uh, that's what we're doing here, man. So, I'm going to let this go just a little bit, and I'm going to have some breakfast. Bam. Mmm. Mmm. God for another day. Mm -hmm. All right, man. I got this, and you got the cheese. And aren't you happy? Yeah. I don't have any more for you, though. Who needs eggs when you got bacon and uh, good cheddar cheese, man? Cheddar cheese from the Republic of Vermont. Give it a little clean. I'll clean it in the house anyway. Man. Damn. Don't get any better than this. So overall, I was pretty happy with this. Some snow melted. take off.
Yeah. Pretty good amount of snow there. It's all compacted now. <laughs> 